watching your gliders facing. So you are kind of facing off that way, your glider's facing this way. So make sure you're exactly lined up because when you hit that throttle, it's critical you go the direction your glider goes or things get a little weird. <laughs> I'll watch that wing then, I just want to... Um, feel. Yeah. See, these risers don't want to be twisted. It's like a swing set. Remember the swing set yeah. and you try and turn and it untwists you? That's how hard you're fighting this. In order to put a twist in it, you're like and fighting it. If you just relax and let it point you, it'll automatically point you the correct direction. Because when you're facing forwards, those risers do not want to be twisted. So they're telling you which way to point. Just relax and let them tell you. Go for it. Left foot in the middle and turn and step into the wind. Drop the glider an inch to your right before you turn to the right though. There you go, bam, nice. There you go, slow to a stop. So go about one step. You turn and take about a step and then slow to a stop. And get it centered. Yep, there you go. Little both brakes, stay under the glider. If it pulls you one ounce to the side, go with it. Do not lean, do not. So when the glider drags you to the side, do not put that foot out and fight it. You have to go effortlessly with it. Second you fight it, one second later, it drags you that way. So you wanna make sure that you're floating and staying perfectly under it. Yep, go with it and cross the legs. Beautiful, there we go. Left brake quarter inch, right brake quarter inch. Keep it exactly above you. Left brake quarter inch, walk to the left, right. Yep, there you go. Right brake a quarter inch, there you go. And let's see, you should be facing this to, yep, nope, right here, right here. Yep, just relax and untwist the risers. You should face this way now. Don't go backwards. Uh, turn the wrong way. So the glider was falling to your right and you turned left. So make sure you turn the direction it's falling. Turn where it's falling, baby. Lots of pieces. <laughs> You're getting close though. There you go, left foot in the middle and drop the glider an inch to the right, bam, turn, one step, break, bring your body to a stop, bam, there you go, lay down. Here we go, little both brakes, lean into it. Left, little left, little both brakes, keep that lean going, and hands up, hands up, fall. Nope, nope, no, nope, no, nope. okay, wait, 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 break, 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 break. Okay, so for our run and jump, here's the steps. You hold a little brake, so you're leaning into it, which you should always do. Then you're gonna throw your hands up about four inches. That's gonna unload the glider. Don't move, your body's gonna start falling forward. Once your body falls forward, run. Once it falls back behind you and starts lifting you, that's where you jump. Now, when you put your hands up and you start falling, don't stand up or you just lost all your loading. And don't run at the same time you put your hands up or you never get in front of your glider. So you want your glider to surge. And so you put your hands up, boom, glider surges, you start falling, boom, that's when you run. So here we go, little break, lean against it, just a little, not too violent. There you go, a little right, touch your right, stay under the glider, left, and left brakes, lean against it, keep the glider perfect, right brake a half inch, hands up, fall, run, 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 jump, full brakes, full brakes, full brake, hands up, hands up, brake, brake, feel that? It's like effortless, even though you kind of jacked it up, it was a hundred times better. <laughs> it's almost effortless. So, when you fall forward, you want to crouch as you run because you, don't, you can't jump from your tippy toes. So you kind of drop your chest as you run and that way you can jump from a crouch. Side step under it, there, that was the correct direction. Very nice, very nice. Beautiful, left foot in the middle, drop the glider an inch to the right. Touch your left, bam, move into it. Both brakes to bring your body to a stop. So stop your body with brakes, not with feet. Ounce of right, break, hands up. Fall, wait, 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 start again, abort. If the glider goes sideways, never jump if the glider's not above you. Side step under it, stay under it. Face exactly away from your glider. Boom, there you go, lean into it. Little touch of both brakes, but don't go backwards. Lean, lean, hands up. Fall, 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 run, jump. Full brakes, all the brakes, hands up slowly. Perfect, beautiful, there we go, there we go. That was an A plus. And you just, it's just so effortless when you get that timing. 
And this is exactly how we're gonna fly with the motor. Turn around, you hit the throttle, you're gonna accelerate with brakes. As soon as the glider starts lifting you, bam, little brakes, and you just pop off the ground effortlessly. Just nothing to it. But you gotta get the timing and all those little pieces are critical. <laughs> you mess up one piece and it's ugly. If you jump when the glider surged in front of you, you, you did nothing, you unloaded yourself. So you gotta jump when it lifts you. Here we go, a little left. 